Welcome to Desert Isle Crafting. I'm Christy. Good morning, everyone. How are you today? Today is Tuesday, the 22nd of August, and boy, this month is almost gone. I hope you all are doing great and making beautiful things. What I have for you today is a kind of combination review from GBFKE. I have a diamond painting that has AB drills. They're really putting those out there now, and I think they're beautiful. I wanted to show it to you, and cross-stitch, and a diamond painting pen. So I hope that if you if you like cross-stitch, you'll take a look at the diamond painting stuff, but if you don't, that's fine. I totally understand, and vice versa. I like the fact that GBFKE sells such a variety of different things, and if you have never been to your, their website before, check them out. They are budget-friendly. They have a massive, massive selection of items, and I'll have a link for you down below. But before we start, I just would like to say thank you to all my subscribers. Welcome. Thank you for watching my videos. I really, really appreciate it. And if you like this video, please hit that like button. So we're drying out from the rain, and it's going to start to warm up again. But boy, I really enjoyed the coolness and all that water. How's things been where you are? I hope things are good and that your weather's not too bad. Um, I'm really looking forward to summer being over, I'll say that. So let's get started on this. I'm going to start with the diamond painting first. Now this diamond painting I thought was really, really pretty. And it has 35 colors, which is a good number of colors. The more colors, I think the more detail. Let's see if I can get this, this open here. Now, this diamond painting was $8.60, which I think is a really good price considering that they have the AB drills. I'm going to roll it backwards. The canvas is really soft, and I recognize this printing here. It looks like it was made by Huacan on AliExpress. That's what their diamond painting legends look like. They're printing. I could be wrong, but that's who I think did it. Very, very soft, pliable, poured blue canvas. It doesn't have any of the felt on the side. We've got a beautiful legend here, which is just like a cross-stitch legend. So we have our product number, our size 40 by 30. We've got our symbols, our DMC codes, and then they actually tell you how many drills they give you of a certain color. This is good to keep in case you have a problem, you run out of drills, and contact them. We've got a picture in the corner down here, and this is a hummingbird. Really super colorful. I thought this was just beautiful. And then on this side we have the same thing. So we have our legend. And we have our picture. So let's take a look at this. It's so glary. I gotta have these lights up. I'll put a picture on the screen of what this looks like. Let me try to get this just a little bit flatter. It is extremely sticky. You can roll these poured glue canvases backwards to try to flatten them out. Don't do that with double-sided tape, though. Let me try this. Okay. Let's take a look at this. We've got the hummingbird here in the middle, and then we've got like a sun, rays coming off the top. I just thought this was a really, really pretty picture. The symbols do have the little circles around them you know, that people call training wheels. It's very, very clear, easy to read. So in the dark areas, your symbols are white, and in the lighter areas, they're dark. So there's no mistaking anything here. Very dark symbols. Easy to see. If you haven't tried diamond painting, I, I really suggest you do. Buy a kit that's a reasonable price, like this store has. I think this kit was $8.60. They do have them way, way cheaper than that. And GBFKE up at the top of the screen does have a sale section that you can look at. 
it's just so easy to do. Now they give you a nice little toolkit with this. So we have our pen with a little squishy holder. We have two pads of wax, a tray, and we actually even have a multi-placer. And that way, when you have your beads in here, you can go in, pick up a whole bunch at one time. It does take a little practice and then do a whole line of the same color at once. And we have some tweezers. These aren't my favorite at all. I would use, I like to use tweezers with diamond painting, especially with AB drills, because they have that, that iridescent coating on them that makes them look so, so pretty. So let's get this put away. Good toolkit, but could, could put better tweezers in there, I think. Now let's look at these drills. Ooh, right off the bat, I can see some really pretty colors. And I like the fact that they have these individually bagged, and we'll take a look at the stickers that they put on them, if I can figure out where to get this open at. Okay, let's take these out. I wasn't going to take them all out, but I really want to see which ones are the ABs. Okay, so this bag does have the product number on it. So if you do store yours separately from your um, canvas, that's great. Now look at this color. Can you see that? That has a coating, a bluey green coating on it. It says AB939. So it's an AB Navy drill. It's number 17. I love that they, that they do this. So they give you your DMC code, which is 939. They tell you how many are in the bag, and that's number 17 on the legend. So let's look at this really quickly. Now the way they have this orientated, the drills are like this, so you'll work on this sideways. They don't have it switched around, so number 17 is a little E. So let's see where we can find little E to see where that color goes. And it's going to be a white symbol. So it looks like it's up here in the sky. So this gorgeous color here. I thought I saw one up here. Unless I'm losing my mind. Here we go. Look at all of those. So this is just going to make that sky just sparkle. Is that just beautiful? Those are so pretty. And we have more. And usually, the AB diamond paintings, the ones that come with these drills, they really jack the price up on. I mean, this picture was only $8.60. This is number 13, so we'll find number 13 on our diamond painting, and that's a, the A right there. And that would go over in here. See all these A's around in here. So it looks like this sky is going to be a mixture of these. My goodness, that's just so pretty. And that's all you do. You just find your your number on your legend. Symbol A. So anywhere you see symbol A is where you're going to put your drills. Now you can use that pen or you can use some tweezers. I usually use tweezers like this. These are my favorite tweezers. And when I bought Hukon diamond paintings from their actual store on AliExpress, um, and you, I've ordered square diamond paintings, they come with these tweezers. And I like them because they're really super pointy. Let me show you. Let me pour some into a tray. So we'll just show you a couple here real quick, and I'll show you why. So just give it a little jiggle. And then you just pick them up, 
like that and then you just place them down on where they go and these these pointy tweezers just seem to work so good but isn't that gorgeous the way those sparkle that's just going to be beautiful absolutely beautiful we've got some more ab's here too here is a really pretty blue this is dmc code 798 12 and that is a dark x so wherever we see a dark x on here that's where this color will go i don't want to waste too much time here we also have a purple ab this is 550 purple my goodness sakes that's pretty and we have another blue ab this is dmc code 996 this is a light blue this picture is just gonna sparkle and i just can't get over the price on this i think that's all of them I think that's all the ABs we've got. So we've got the sky, and then we've got the blue here. I'm curious on this blue, number 21, that is that upside down arrow. I don't know if you can see that very good. I'm hoping that's, yeah, that's right here on the hummingbird wing. So yeah, the hummingbird's gonna sparkle, and so is the sky. How pretty is this? absolutely gorgeous let me get this all back in here and so what I what I found on GBFKE's website was also a diamond painting pen the pen they give you in the package here is skinny I mean they do put a little poofy on it which makes it so much easier to hold but if you have sore hands or arthritis holding something that tiny can be painful and difficult one moment please I've got a barky dog. Sorry about that. There was a road runner outside and she barks every time she sees one. Now this pen was $6.42. Let's open it up so I can show it to you. I love these, these big fat resin pens because they're just so much more comfortable to hold. It comes with your tip. You just stick that in the end push it in and then it comes with a multi-placer so I think that's probably a five or so six and it's just it's well weighted it's really pretty look at the sparkly flowers they have a whole lot of different ones to choose from really colorful you can get a nice little collection of these going you see it's got the it's not totally straight so it's got a great little section here for you to um, hold your fingers around and then that sits on your hand and it just makes it a lot more comfortable to be able to diamond paint so that is a really pretty pen I thought that was cute yeah six dollars and 42 cents okay then we'll get on to the cross stitch if you have any questions about diamond painting please let me know it is a great hobby. It's a beautiful craft to do. I think I've shown you some of the pictures I've done. And I just absolutely love diamond painting. I just feel bad that I've gotten away from it because I've been so into the cross stitch lately. But yeah, that's the hummingbird. I think she'll be really, really pretty. Really, really pretty. Oh, I didn't get a measurement on this really quick. I wanted to tell you what size she was. And I'm just doing it sideways because of the camera. So she is the actual picture. It's a little over 15 and a half inches wide by 11 and three quarters. So that's not, not a bad size at all. And with this many colors, I think the detail will show up just fine. The other thing I wanted to show you from GBFKE is a cross stitch kit. Okay, so we have our tool kit with five needles, 
a threader, and a thimble. Let's see which one this is. So this is a flower heart, and I love the colors of this. I thought it was so pretty. It's a 40 by 40. It's an 11 count. It tells you that up at the top, along with the product number. And the stitch, 148 across, 148 up and down. We've got our directions here on how to cross stitch. And then we have our pattern. So, unfortunately, I have to say this is an extremely blurry pattern. The red, these areas in here, you can't even see them. We had one of these last week from this manufacturer. Look how nasty that is. I'm going to have to contact GBFKE and send them some pictures. 42 colors. This background is 5200 all white. A lot of confetti in this. This pat paper pattern is essentially useless because it's blurry all over. Let's look at the actual uh, fabric. This isn't a bad size at all. It's not too big. We have our serged edges. It's identical to the pattern, paper pattern, except it's not blurry. It is very clear and easy to read. The canvas will stiffen up. It's an 11 count. So we have our legend with 42 colors, which I'm really happy that there's so many colors in this because it'll make it really, really pretty. You can do this without this paper pattern. Just be really careful. Don't have wet hands. Don't have liquids around it because if it gets wet, it's going to smear. We have our DMC codes, our symbols, and then this number tells you which thread to grab. Let's take a look at these, but before we do, I wanted to get a measurement on the actual picture itself. Okay, so it's 13 and a little over a quarter by about 13 and a half? A little over 13 and a half. So it's not exactly a square, but it's almost a square. Very, very clearly printed. Let's look at the flats. So being that this whole background is 5200 white, you don't have to stitch it if you don't want to. But they do give it to you. Here's three hanks of 5200 white. Each hank has 40 strands. So each strand is six threads. You'll divide this up and use three threads for your stitching. Put those up there. Let's see if we can go a little higher. Now let's look at the colors. I like this because it looked like it had a lot of teal in here. I hope they do. So we've got purple. We've got two different floss cards here because there's just so many. So here's yellow. There's some teal, orange, 38 purple. That's 38, 35. Very soft floss. And then over here, there's so many colors in this. Nine is 550, and then this pink is 600. Awfully pretty. Gorgeous colors. And then this side, we have some navies, some tans, pinks, greens. There's some more teal. Really pretty colors of floss. That pattern seems to me like it might have, I mean, it's not damp, but I mean, I would think that maybe it got wet or something. I don't know. But yeah, you can still work on this kit. Your pattern's just worthless. I will be sending an email to GBFKE about that. Really pretty colors, though. Really pretty colors for this. 
and I will have a picture up on the screen for you to see this. I think I probably put it up earlier. But yeah, very, very pretty. This kit was $8.71. So considering all this floss you get, I think it's wonderful. I think it's a great kit. Good price. I think it's worth the money. And what happens when you contact them about something like this blurry pattern that's absolutely useless, they will send you another one. That's why it's important to know your product number. I do like the fact they bag their floss separately and that it's just not floating around in there with, with this. And if you're unsure about where that product number is, it is right here on your floss bag. Right here and on your actual fabric. But yeah, that's going to be a beautiful heart. They have quite a few different ones of these hearts. You could do a collection of these. You could make a wall hanging. You could put them in frames and put them on a wall together. That would be really, really pretty. You could even make these into a pillow, I would think, once you get it all stitched up. There's just so much variety with cross stitch. So many things that you can do besides just hang a picture up on a wall. I love cross stitch. I think it's wonderful. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope I didn't do go too long with the diamond painting, but AB Drills, now that they've made those pictures not quite as expensive, it, it really adds to the picture, and I really wanted to show that to you. So please check out GBFKE. Their link is down below along with links to these products. If you like this video, please hit that like button. I would really, really appreciate it. I hope you all have a wonderful day. Take care. God bless, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.